What's going on? Nick here from Side Hustle Nation, here to help you improve your personal profitability. Today, we're talking about free money, what it is, why it exists, how you can get some for yourself, and what you might consider doing instead if you're really serious about making more money. First up, is there really such a thing as free money? I believe there is, but like anything, it depends on what you define as free. If a company or a government is giving you free money, remember, it's an exchange for value. They're expecting some sort of return for that. If the government is giving you some sort of grant, it's because they hope you're going to be paying tax dollars down the road. So think of it like free samples at a grocery store. The uh, company knows that if they give a little bit away, on average, people are going to buy more than enough product to make that a profitable endeavor. But let's get into some ways to earn some free money for yourself. Now, the single best way to earn free money is your company's 401k matching program. A lot of companies have this program in place where they will match up to a certain percentage of your salary uh, contributions to your retirement plan. If you're not currently taking advantage of this, this would be my first priority. Highly recommend you do this because it is legitimately free money. The downside is you can't access it until your retirement age. So if you're in the point of needing money like yesterday, not the best option, but definitely one worth looking into. So what are some legit strategies if you wanna get paid a little bit faster? First on my list and my personal favorite is credit card rewards and specifically new credit card signup bonuses. Now I know this is a slippery slope for a lot of people, a sensitive subject. If you have trouble managing your spending, probably wouldn't recommend this, but what it looks like is it's not uncommon for companies to offer uh, a sign-up bonus for new users because they hope and they know on average that they're going to be making money off of your interest for years to come. So don't be that person. Be the person that beats the average and pay your credit card off every month. Don't buy stuff you can't afford just because you have the ability to. So for example, one common uh, offer, at least at press time, is $150 cash back if you spend $500 in your first three months after opening this new account. And I don't know about you, but if you're gonna spend that $500 anyways, you, wouldn't you be better off having that $150 back? It definitely is what I qualify as free money. I'll link up in the description below how to find some of the best current credit card offers. Next up in my free money arsenal is a kind of a library of cash back apps. And how these work is if you shop through a certain app or if you use a certain linked credit card, these companies will give you back a percentage of your per of your purchase, normally a small percentage, but hey, every little bit adds up and I'll link up a few of my favorites down below as well. The next interesting angle to get free money is one that a lot of Side Hustle Nation readers have taken advantage of, and that's actually to get a free share of stock when you sign up for the brokerage Robinhood. And they say you can get companies like Visa or Microsoft as part of this free stock draw. I ended up getting Groupon with mine, but hey, you never know, so it might be worth a shot there. Another way to get free money is by selling your data, which admittedly sounds a little bit creepy to me, but there are some legit companies that operate in this space. Basically, companies want to know how regular people like you and I are using our phones and computers, and they will pay you a little bit to install your uh, install their app on your devices and basically share that information with them. A couple of the more reputable players are called Mobile Expressions and Nielsen uh, as consumer monitoring service. Um, we'll pay you up to 50 bucks a year to install these apps on your devices. The next way to get free money is to get paid to share your opinion. And admittedly, this isn't totally free because it does take your time, but getting paid to talk is pretty much the next best thing, right? One of my favorite resources to do this is a site called User Interviews. Basically, this is a platform or a marketplace that will match you up with online remote research studies, and they pay an average of $50 to $200 an hour for your time. And I've got a full review video on User Interviews if you want to check that out. The main downside is that they tend to pay in Amazon gift cards instead of cash, but if your spending habits are anything like our household, you know we're going to use it on Amazon eventually, so I'm fine with that. I've got several suggestions on other ways you can earn free or almost free money on my website, which I will link up in the description below. But here's the thing. None of them are going to be a consistent long-term source of meaningful income. To be sure, every dollar counts, but to have bigger results, you're going to have to take bigger action. 
Remember, where does money come from? Money comes from exchanging value. Money comes from solving problems. There are hundreds of side hustle ideas and business ideas over in the Side Hustle Nation archives. I encourage you to check those out. And I've even got a dedicated playlist right here on YouTube on some fast, simple side hustles that you can get started this weekend. My encouragement would be to pick something, take action on it, see what you liked, see what you didn't like, and then keep moving. Action breeds action, and that skill of figuring it out as you go is going to be far more valuable than any amount of, quote, free money you can get from items on this list.